Hello, um, sorry, I was trying to type the topic of my life, um, life session, life class, either way. Um, I understand everybody is inside, even here in the UK, we are not allowed to go out except to go and shop, buy one or two things, then maybe one hour walk around, exercise, and then you have to go back to your house or you get arrested. So today I was able to go out. To do some shopping anyways and i decided to um all uh, being the an opportunity to go out so i decided okay it's an opportunity for me to go out snap pictures that i needed for my page especially so i had to go up and snap the pictures okay what i want to talk about is how to mix and match your colors um i understand a lot of people do struggle with that especially when it comes to looking good ladies especially you want to look good the truth is most of the time you have everything you need to look good you have it in your wardrobe but because first of all you have not taken time to arrange your wardrobe in a way that you can easily you know if everything let's say your trousers are here tops are here dresses here shoes jewelries everything is well arranged if everything is well arranged it becomes easy for you to be able to mix and match colors but when everything is all jam-packed together you get confused and at the end of the day you just pick what is available and you just go and then i notice a lot of people like to go for black black is not a bad color but it's not a color you want to keep wearing every day because color usually de determines your mood color determines how you feel and that's something a lot of people don't know the color you wear matters a lot especially if for me, there are some places I will never wear black to. And it's not because they are going to go against that. If I'm going to wear the black, it's just going to be something like this. So that the accessories I'll be wearing is going to make it look a bit brighter. And make it, as in, it's not going to make everything look all gloomy. Because black has a way of bringing that um, dull look and impression to everything around you. Black is good during winter. It's, it preserves your body heat. But when it is summer, black is not a color I would go for. I may only go for it depending on what I'm wearing under or like my pants or my skirt or my shoe. I like, I really, I rarely wear blacks. And the black, uh, the black top, black tops and dresses I have, I don't even have a dress. I think it's only black tops that I have. They are mostly gifts. I think it's only one that i bought with my money this one i'm wearing is a gift as well i don't like black tops i can still go for black pants skirts and all that but for a top i don't like it mostly because it determines my mood so you have to be um careful with how you wear colors if you want to have a um, positive outlook and good mood and all that wear bright colors it affects your mood it affects how you feel you may not understand it but the day you try this out you will see the difference start wearing more of brighter colors like yellow white off-white cream pink all those kind of colors even red you can just tone down the colors so they're they not too flashy by mixing with a little bit a darker shade of that same color or a different shade that matches the color so now how do you mix and match your colors just like i'm wearing now this is black and yellow with some uh, with a touch of white on the neck piece so you can choose what you want to wear my glasses is a recommended one so i can't really choose what color but when i was choosing this anyway i deliberately go for a color that will that will go with almost every kind of color i would be wearing like every other color so i deliberately chose this i used to wear a black one but the day i was to even choose another one there was there was black but i wanted something different that was i went for this color and it was it's still something i can go with every other color so you have to choose a color like um stylishly there was a time i wore a black top this way and a black um boot cut with a pink um waistcoat that has a that's a peplum type then my shoe was a burgundy shoe and a burgundy bag that's me wearing three colors and it's still going to it still came out really nice i remember how yes i really drew attention with the way i was looking so while it is not why the goal may not be to draw attention the goal is to build your confidence how you dress really build, it affects your confidence if you dress well and you're looking good frequently it helps your self-esteem it builds your confidence and you begin to feel 
better as, as time goes on and that is, would even encourage you to do more so if you want to feel better as well work on your dressing work on how you look work on how you i mean how you you present yourself in terms of your outfit now there are colors you can match together you can use um white and red with black you can go for um you know the monochrome look different shades of a particular color that's you can go for green with um mint green um I'm, i mean emerald green mint green and that kind of look we can go for nude kind of look and if you are going for black please i wouldn't say you should do except you are mourning or going for burial ceremony i will not say you use black as a, as a monochrome look mix it up with other bright colors like white red yellow um pink those are good colors to make your outfit stand out so you you want to if you are wearing a dark color especially down maybe like your skirt you, you will want to go for brighter colors at the top you want to go for the colors that would accentuate with your body as at the same time also be aware of your skin color if if i was a bright i mean um fair lady now black is, may not be a big deal for me i'm i'm thinking naturally i would like black if i was dark i mean fair in complexion but because i'm even dark more reason why i wouldn't even like black brown all those kind of colors i may go for brown i can still manage brown and navy and maybe navy blue but black is not really my favorite and it's basically because of my skin color i want a color that is going to bring out my skin color that will that would blend with my color that's going to fit me and not make me look even darker and that's why if i have to wear black i make sure my accessory is lighter like it's bright it's a bright color just the way it is here so you want to if you want to achieve a good look i think the first step is to go to your wardrobe and arrange it let your jean trousers be in a particular place let your normal trousers be in a different place let your tops be in a different place then when you're arranging them arrange the colors in a way that they would like let's say all your shades of blue let them be in a particular spot all your shades of red let them be in a particular spot all your shades of um pink let them be in a particular spot so that by the time you want to go out naturally it will flow you'll be able to blend these colors together and pick the one you want to go for so basically what i'm saying is arrange your wardrobe first start from your wardrobe uh, rearrange it to a in a way that you can easily pick a, a top a, a dress a shoe a bag to Together and everything will just balance together. No, then go. So, just pick what you want. Arrange your wardrobe. When you, the first step is arrange your wardrobe. When you arrange your wardrobe, it becomes easy to style yourself. While I understand that sometimes it can be like, oh, I don't want to do this. I'm not interested. Especially if you are the very busy type, it becomes easier if you are able to arrange your wardrobe. You wouldn't even need to think too much. Like everything is well arranged. By the time you even open your wardrobe or wherever you put your clothes in, the address will just fall on you. So basically, arrange your wardrobe, and so that that way you are able to mix and match your colors together. I'm hoping I've been able to um, drop, I mean, impart some ideas into you that can help you, so you can step up your game and look good. Don't and at the same time, don't say because. Um, you are not really going out now you don't want to look good please look good for yourself inside your house dress well and look good be fine be happy i don't have okay since this um fact that we have to stay indoors i've i can count how many times i've been out maybe three times and that's like once a week and that once a week means that i really go out but at the same time i would not say because i'm not going out i don't dress well okay i went out today but yesterday i didn't but i dressed well i think i even did some live videos on facebook so the reason I dress up is not even because of anything, but because it boosts my confidence. When you look good, it has a way of boosting your confidence. Your self-esteem is going to get better. So try as much as possible to put effort into looking good. Arrange your wardrobe, put your colors together, arrange the colors, um, the same range of colors in the same place. Let them be arranged together. Blacks be together. Shades of yellow, let them be together. Shades of blue, let them be together. Shades of red, let them be together. So that way, when they are together, it becomes easy for you to pick which one you want to pick. And then when you are wearing, so there are some colors that they are too bright. You don't want to wear them together because wearing them together, it may it may draw unnecessary attention that you wouldn't want. There are some dark colors. I wore one outfit sometimes ago. I went for a seminar. 
it was a navy blue navy blue and it's a black jumpsuit but it has a um a, a navy blue kind of cape at the top and going by that color alone is not my kind of color but because i was able to balance the whole outfit let me see if i can get one of the pictures to show you uh it's going to be very far it's been a long time ago that i snapped the picture i don't know if i'll see it i was but bottom line is that i was able to despite it being a dark color i was able to balance it okay i've gotten it let me let me get it let me bring it out so you can see what i'm talking about i actually posted it on my page as well yeah this picture that's the picture i'm talking about it, the top the top there is a navy blue kind of cape um this side is there is a black jumpsuit with a navy blue cape then i wore this white um this thing on it and carried my my shoe is a white shoe my bag my bag has a blue it's it's mixture of blue red and white so everything is mixed together in a way that way even though what the color i'm wearing inside was dark because i wore a white cardigan on it it makes it look unique it makes it look different meanwhile if i wear that ordinary the jumpsuit you wouldn't even you may not even look at me twice but because i was able to blend the colors so in a bot um, bottom line is try as much as possible to blend the colors white and blue and black go together black and pink go together black and yellow go together you can go for burgundy and pink they go together as well or you can do burgundy pink and black they go together white yellow and black they go together i'm just like giving you an idea so it can help you and so that you can start arranging your wardrobe so that even by the time they're saying okay you're not free to go out you're coming out with a difference you're coming out with a bang and people will be looking at you like ah, all this your own indoor is like you were busy trying to arrange your wardrobe so really even if you don't want to do anything just try and at least for your own confidence try to work on your wardrobe and your styling so that way you look different and your confidence begin to get better thank you very much for joining this um live um video let me see if i can quickly show you one more picture before i go off um i've scrolled too much um oh daniel please go and get the juice Okay, here's another one. It's still the same um, um, kind of style, but a different inner outfit and a different shoe. That's another style there that you may want to try. Let me give you one more style idea and then I'll call it a day. Um, okay, let me use it today's picture because my scrolling back is, is kind of taking forever for me. What is it? Um okay yeah this is it that's me today that was earlier today when i went out so it's just a, a, a way of mixing your colors the truth is you can actually wear a particular dress four times it's just the way you style it that will make it look like a new one or something different so i hope this is helpful to you and i hope it's going to help you a little bit thank you so much and have a lovely afternoon bye